the way my double chin was double chinning, I was like, uh uh. Hey Kings, welcome back to another video. My name is Portia if you're new, but if you're not new, welcome back. Today's 16 and 17 of Vlogmas. Yeah, we're gonna combine this vlog. This is gonna be 16 and 17 because I started vlogging like the intro that y'all seen with the whole tea making thing. I started that vlog two days ago, but I did not finish vlogging because your girl got sick. Still kind of sick, which I knew was gonna happen because every time Vea gets sick, I get sick right after. So I knew I was gonna get sick, but it's just giving common cold. I haven't had any like symptoms of like fever or nothing. It's just been stuffy nose, itchy throat, just a common cold. So I have not been vlogging. So now we're in like real time. Today is Friday, December 16th. So got hair right here. So yeah, we're in real time now because your girl, was sick and was not vlogging so well i'm still kind of sick but i feel a little bit better today i've been doing real good with my tea this week but right now i'm at work i'm on lunch break and i'm about to go to the dollar store to get some tape and some cleaning items because i want to clean up and i want to wrap gifts tonight so i'm going to go ahead and get it now while i'm on lunch break so that when i get off work i'm not gonna have to worry about it my sister called me. She said she wanted to go to some like drive-by lights event. We're probably not gonna go because I'm still kind of stuffy. So it's a stretch. I'm still stuffy and I wanna clean up and wrap gifts and just get everything together tonight. I might end up filming a video tonight just so I can get back one day, at least one day ahead. And on top of that, tomorrow, Alicia and I are supposed to be taking the girls to some little christmas event we've seen on facebook it's supposed to have like a lot of activities for the kids and stuff so we're supposed to be taking them tomorrow me and they are not going out two nights in a row it's a no and plus it's friday you know i just want to chill i want to wrap i really want to wrap those gifts tonight they're literally sitting under the tree and they're getting on my last nerve i need to get rid of some of Vea's old clothes that are too little just basic stuff it's getting cold outside it's been cold this week so i do need to get her like some winter basics some long sleeve shirts undershirts stuff like that so i really want to get that done this weekend and i also need to find a ugly christmas sweater i seen some at walmart when we went to go get the ornaments last weekend so i think i'm just gonna go back to walmart and get me like an ugly christmas sweater and wear it with some jeans or something because we have a ugly christmas sweater party next week y'all i'm so excited i'm happy that i started a new job in the middle of the holidays so i get to participate in all of the holiday fun um i started my new job this week and i absolutely love it like literally i love the group of people that i work with um the work that i'm doing is just you know very right now at least very low stress i'm going to be able to travel um like go on work trips and it's just a really nice company and i really enjoy the atmosphere the environment the work literally i think my presence in the office has been like just like the perfect touch i feel like the personalities it, it just mix so well so i really do think this was a very good move for me and i'm really blessed and really grateful i needed this i needed my little fairy tale ending to a very chaotic year i'm excited and like i said i'm joining in the middle of the holidays so i get to join all the holiday festivities we had a christmas lunch this week in the office and it was really nice and i got to meet you know everybody that works in the office and everybody's just so welcoming and yeah so i really do like my new job y'all so that's that i'm about to get ready to head to the dollar store even though i'm only going in there for a few items y'all know i'm gonna look around and see what they got so yeah let's go so i think this is gonna
gonna be like my little designated spot for right now because I don't know if y'all remember, but a while ago, I told y'all, I think that was in October, I told y'all I was in the process of redoing my filming area in which I'm still in the process. Some things have to be rearranged. So I'm literally just putting that to, well, I put that to the back burner until after the holidays because truth be told, I'm not going to be pushing out that content until after the holidays. So yeah, this is going to be the new talking spot for right now. It is later on. Actually, it's like 12 o'clock at night. I've surfaced, cleaned the house. Gave a bath, I took a bath, and I lit my candle, and I cut on the Christmas tree, and um, now I feel better, because <laughs> I was so annoyed earlier, like, so annoyed. Well, first of all, let me just tell y'all, I don't know what, well, I do know, when you're good to people, good things happen, like, there is a such thing as good karma, so I think that's what it is, because... I feel like I'm pretty decent to people. Like, I'm, you know, if you're decent to me, I'm decent to you. Like, so anyways, I said all of that to say, I told y'all we ordered Vea's car, right? We have like an Amazon package center or whatever. And they'll send, like, even if I don't order from Amazon, like, they'll still put the packages there. Like, that's just like the package center. But there is no cubby hole or like locker that's big enough to hold that box which i knew so i knew they were going to put it at the front door while we weren't here but you know i wasn't really concerned about it like, i wasn't concerned like i didn't think anybody was going to take it or anything like that so i got home and we had a note on the door our neighbors basically took the package for us because they said that it was a picture of the car on the package and it was a really big package. So they didn't want one, somebody to steal it or two for me and Vea to get home and she just sees the package and sees the picture of the car on the box and be like, oh, that's my Christmas gift. And that was really nice of them. Um, so that's why I have on a hoodie right now because I had to go outside. I told them that I was gonna come get it once she went to sleep. I don't know how I'm going to wrap it because they're saying it's a really, really big box. So, I don't know how I'm going to wrap it, but child, I don't know. We'll have to figure something out. But, yeah, that was just really sweet of them. Like, it's just been really sweet, nice things happening. <sighs> I'm just filled with gratefulness. It's just, it really does feel like the holiday season. Like, it's just been so, like, even with the guy paying for our meal the other day, it's just, I don't know. I feel like it's good karma. I told y'all I wanted to clean and wrap gifts tonight. We did clean, but I really don't feel like wrapping gifts. Like, I feel like I, I'm still stuffy. And I, instead of me being on, like, go mode, like, I gotta do this, I gotta do that. I need to take me some night quill and go to bed like <laughs> like i don't understand what's wrong with me i don't know why i feel like i have to constantly be on go mode like i don't i don't know i mean i do know but i feel like if i'm not like exactly where i want to be then i gotta keep going hard you know like i have to push myself i feel like i have to push myself beyond my limits because i was watching my girl amia's video today she's basically just saying she wants to get back into doing things for herself and doing things that just reaching her goals because she's more than a mother she's more than a wife and which i completely get it in order to wear so many hats right you want to be a business owner but you're also a mother you're also a wife in order for you to push to get to your goals because obviously certain things are priorities they're going to come first you know that's just how it is how it's going to go and if you want to do more than if you want to accomplish more than just that then you have to wake up earlier you have to stay up later you know you have to create extra time in your day for those things that you want for yourself your individual self 
So it's just very tiring and knowing that you have to do that, like you basically have to stay on go mode. Like you have to be prepared to be tired. You have to be willing to be tired, willing to wake up early, willing to stay up late if you want that, you know. Yeah, so I think that's probably why I'm just so on go mode all the time. Like, gotta do this, gotta do that. But I am going to shut down tonight because I do need to recover. I do want to feel better. So, yeah, I'm about to take some NyQuil, some melatonin, and I'm about to go to bed. So, I just want to come and let y'all know. I did vlog while I was in the dollar store, but I deleted that footage because the way my double chin was double chinning i was like uh-uh i'm not even gonna do myself like that like absolutely not I should get the miles away.